What should you do when you have a free minute and you don't want to waste it, but you also don't want to put in effort? We have a new series of life hacks just for those moments. For the first idea, take a couple of glasses, skittles, and straws. Pour the candy on the table. Take a straw and try to collect as many skittles as possible, sucking in the air. Each player puts the candy they get in their glass. Victory goes to whoever collects more candies. Don't overreact, this is just a game! For the next idea, take a pair of toy cars and two flat magnets. Hot glue the magnets to the toy cars. Take pencils. Glue a couple of magnets to them so that identical repelling poles in the toy cars and on the pencils are directed outwards. Look, the cars run away from the stick by themselves. This is real magic, or is it just physics? And now take a cardboard cup and some gouache. Pour a few drops of paint on the bottom of the cup. Dilute the gouache with water to fill half of the cup. Take shower gel and pour it into the mixture. Mix thoroughly. Make several cups with multicolored paints. Take a straw and blow in the cups. Foaming bubbles! Apply white sheets of paper to the foam. When the paint dries, collect a composition from the sheets. A picture like this will look great anywhere and make an excellent gift. Next, take a glass bottle of Pepsi and some webbing. Tie the webbing on the bottleneck. Pour hot water inside. Add food coloring and mix thoroughly. Take a large flask with cold water. Slowly immerse the bottle with ink in it, holding it by the webbing. Put it on the bottom and observe the eruption of an underwater volcano. It's amazing to watch! And now we will show what you can make from a Pepsi can. Paint it blue. Draw a funny face on it with a thin brush. Don't forget to add details. Draw a smile, nose, hair, and makeup. Try to draw carefully, staying in the lines. Wait until the paint dries. Serve the Pepsi. In a bright package like this, any drink seems tastier. For the next idea, take a few multicolored stickers for notes. Cut out small circles from them. Write different numbers on each circle. Take an empty egg tray. Put the circles with numbers in cells. Take a few balls of different sizes. Put the tray on the table and throw balls into it in turn. Whoever scores the most points wins. And may the best thrower win. For the next life hack, take a bowl with dry cement. Add a glass of water into it and mix everything well with a spoon. Next, take a sheet of cardboard, a glass bottle from Pepsi, and some petroleum jelly. Coat the bottle with the cement solution to make a neat mountain. Do not cover the bottleneck though. When the cement hardens, take silver and red paints. Cover the slopes with silver and draw fiery streaks with red. Next, take a funnel, some baking soda, and vinegar. Insert the funnel into the neck and pour the soda into the bottle. Add a little vinegar and get a home volcanic eruption. Very cute! and completely harmless. And now take a plastic bottle. Make several rows of holes in the middle part using a hot glue gun. Take the cocktail straws. Insert them into holes in a chaotic order, one after the other. Take pom-poms of different sizes and throw them into the bottle through the neck. 
When the bottle is full, the game can start. The players must pull the straws out in a way that the pom-poms do not fall down. Whoever drops the most pom-poms loses. The game is super fun from the first seconds, and it is impossible to stop. Next, you need a sheet of plastic and some dry cement. Add water in a container with cement and stir until you get a homogeneous thick mass. Lay the cement on the plastic to form a ring. Take the second sheet of plastic and put it on top. Press and wait until the cement hardens. Now take a decorative piece of glass and break it into small parts with a hammer. Decorate the blank with different colored rings. Glue the pieces of glass along the inner radius. The result is a beautiful art piece. Now we just have to come up with a mineral name and a beautiful backstory. For the next idea, you need a feather and a glass of water. Pour salt into the water, making a saturated solution. Tie a ribbon to the base of the feather. Immerse the feather in the glass. Stretch the ribbon and tape them to the edges of the glass from the outside. After some time, take the feather out and see that it is covered with salt crystals. The water evaporates and the salt crystallizes on the feather. It's a simple but interesting experience. Try it! And now you are going to need a grow sponge with grains. Take disposable cups and stick funny pictures of friends on them. Place the grow sponges in them. Leave for a few days and do not forget to water them. After a few days, funny hairstyles will start appearing above your friend's pictures. Be sure to show them! For the next life hack, take confetti and a balloon. Inflate the balloon and thoroughly coat it with Elmer's glue to the middle. Generously sprinkle the glue layer with confetti. Repeat the procedure a few times. When the glue dries, burst the balloon with a pin and carefully pull it out. Trim the edges with scissors and get an original bowl for all sorts of household things. Easy and unusual, right? And now take a cardboard box. Cover the inside with colored paper. Take multicolored letters and confetti. Lay them out and glue them inside the box. Make such an inscription. Glue a cardboard cup in the center. Glue a catapult made from a stick and a cap to the bottom of the box. Make sure it's in the middle. Take pom-poms, place them in the catapult, and shoot at the basket. And now the most difficult thing is to hit the target. You have to get the hang of it. For this life pack, you will need an empty juice pack and a soap dish. Cut off the top of the package. Take a tube from toilet paper and glue a cardboard circle on the bottom. Cover it over with a wide piece of tape. Coat everything with petroleum jelly. Take a cement solution and pour it into the pack with a spoon to fill half of it. Place the sleeve in the center. Fill it to the top with cement. Secure the sleeve with a stone and leave it to dry. In the meantime, take the soap dish and also coat it with petroleum jelly from the inside. Fill it with cement. Put a bar of soap in the center of the soap dish. When the cement hardens, take the soap out and remove the soap dish from it. Next, cut and remove the pack and pull out the sleeve from the first piece. Place the new soap dish and the convenient cup for toothpaste and toothbrushes in the bathroom. It's ready to use! Did you like our life hacks to fight boredom? Which of the ideas will you try out? Let us know in the comments. Subscribe to our channel, give this video a like, click on the bell, and share this video with your friends. Bye bye